Hello traders and welcome to another video review. Today is Wednesday, November 29th, 2023. Let's take a look at the Ethereum quoted to Tether at Zonda Crypto. As you can see, I'm using here the candlesticks on a daily time frame chart and I, we are going to apply some uh, practical uh, technical analytic tools uh, to this chart. So what do we see here is a kind of a consolidation which is right now located just between the, the levels of uh, 20 uh, sorry 2131 and the lows is uh, located at uh, route 1911 and this looks like a kind of a very interesting pattern for a few reasons. The one of the reasons is that if we uh, mark this level here, you can clearly see that this is some sort of the uh, technical resistance 2139 and the market tried to uh, test this uh, level already. Uh, the market tried to test this level here and just recently it failed to uh, test it uh, here just a few days ago. So very tight area here very very tight uh, nevertheless uh, we got the situation where we can say something about the potential uh, double high double top forming on this level maybe even a triple one big rejection candle in form of the pin bar uh, with long upper shadow gives us some sort of the clue about who is in charge on this market okay so we know that without breakout above the swing high at 2139 you can't actually see uh, you, you can't actually see any anything um, bullish here on this chart so you can't you won't be able to uh, basically uh, uh, manage to um, say that the uptrend is resuming right because this is the key supply zone and free horizontal technical resistance uh, levels so um, the, where, where is the support so first level of the support is here the second level of the support is um, is here 1910 1949 and of course we can see uh, right let me just move this one somewhere and the, the third one is somewhere around uh, around here so we have three very nice uh, technical support levels there's one more thing we can do to uh, to fill up our uh, our situation with the lines on this chart and that will be uh, I promise almost the, uh, the, the last one we can manage to mark some sort of a very very mm, uh, nice looking triangle pattern or as someone might say a kind of a let's say a um, bullish pennant pattern but you know I prefer the the triangle pattern which has not been completed just yet and when it's done the outlook for the Ethereum looks of course bullish because the once the pattern is done we should expect this market to burst to the upside okay so we should see some sort of the market movement uh, to the upside um, the question is of course when this will happen well no one knows uh, basically when this will happen it's still in progress but don't worry once it's done a big spike to the upside should be uh, on your uh, chart um, what's going on with the momentum because as, as, as I said it's not going on it's not you know in progress currently and the reason for that is the momentum is not that strong whatsoever so if we go to the horizontal line and we will place this horizontal line let's say as close as the 50 level there you go might be here you can see it clearly that uh, the momentum is right now above the level of 50 however it's not that strong it's only uh, let's say 55 points 55 58 points right now we need to see this momentum um, moving uh, to the upside there is a room to the upside here there is a room to the upside on the chart uh, as well so as long the momentum stays positive as long as the momentum stays above the level of 50 the outlook remains bullish but any breakout below uh, this green uh, horizontal 
levels zone uh, basically any breakout below 1878 would change the outlook immediately to to the uh, bearish one so please stay focused stay tuned for another uh, scenario uh, as well because next week we are going to have a update of this uh, situation so thank you very much for watching this analysis i hope you like it i hope you um, enjoy it uh, leave thumbs up subscribe this channel and hopefully we will see each other in a week time thank you very much take care bye bye